Uh, yeah, I mean, I think regardless a fan or not, uh, what he's done for basketball uh, on both the men's and women's side, you know, it, it, it hits home. Um, regardless how strongly you feel about him, or if you know some if you're a hero, or you just you know appreciate his work ethic. Um, I mean, he's such a he's such an icon in the basketball community that uh, it, it hurts. Um, and it's even more sad now that after dedicating his entire life to his craft, uh, he finally had these last couple of years to you know start being a dad, and you know you just tell how much he loved it. Um, so it, it's, it's very sad, and you know you see the opening arms, uh, so you know who's backing him up, and uh, everyone that's talking about him. So he obviously had a, a huge impact, and um, you know definitely was a sad Sunday uh, for myself. Uh, you know, you know I, I love the way he played, how hard he played, and what he put into it, and you know it's like what I try to do every single game, just try to you know play with that that much passion and you know love for the game. Do you ever see him play live or come back or any kind of connection? Unfortunately, I haven't. Uh, I always wanted to, you know, I think it would be so great just to pick his brain. And, you know, but I feel like I've watched enough interviews about him to know what he would say to me. Um, but, you know, that's definitely something that I wish I could have had a chance to do. What about Stanford and getting back on track? Uh, yeah, I mean, right now we have, we have no other option. You know, that's what we got to do. Um, you know, we watch film and Everything that you know is breaking down is all fixable things. Uh, starts defensively, um, and so we start there, and then just more effort. And you know, we got like I said, we got to play with that passion um, every single we step on the court. Just because two weeks ago, you know, we knocked off two top 25 teams, so we're obviously very capable. Uh, it's got to mean something, and uh, you know, I think it's a great chance to do something on the road. Then we come back for three straight home games, so. Uh, you know, looking forward to it, and you know, at this point, we just see what we made out of it. Basketball is a team game, and obviously, everybody needs to do their part. How important is that, especially right now, with what you guys are going through? Yeah, uh, you know, we just gotta again stick to the script that the coaches are giving us, um, and, and buy into what they're saying. That's the biggest part. Um, you know, they're putting a plan in place, and then it's up to us to execute it. Um, and the only way you're gonna get more uh, from the coaches if you. You know, if you buy in, if you if you give them defensively, and, you know, I think that's one thing that's great with uh, my dad is that you know he's, he's a very defensive-minded coach, and so if you give him that, he gives you a lot of freedom on the offensive end. Um, but we watched it, and there was this, you know, not good ball pressure, um, weren't loaded in the gap, so you know it was hard to be back and uh, you know help the helper in a sense. So uh, that's really what it comes down to and where it starts. Your dad's talked a little bit about guys trying to do too much, especially the offense. Have you seen a little bit of that? I think it's just, you know, I think we've been in slumps and uh, people just want to be the ones to help us get out of it. Uh, you know, we just got to execute what we're doing and then be ready to make plays if you want to make a play. Um, don't be afraid to, you know, take the criticism that comes with if you make a mistake or make it up on defensive. and. Um, and then I think that's something that we do is we hang our heads and we make a mistake and we just got to, you know, be tough enough to make sure it doesn't happen again. Uh, but, you know, I think at the end of the day, it's, just, it's nothing selfish. It's just all wanting to help the team. But, you know, we just got to understand time and place. How important is it as a fan to be able to help your young guys understand that, yeah, we're struggling right now, but this thing is done with? Um, yeah, I mean, it's huge. Uh, we were in a similar spot, I think, my freshman year. Uh, and we started off three and six, and then turned around on six and three. So uh, we're definitely capable. Uh, it's just you know staying positive, bringing that positive energy every single day. Uh, and in this back half of the league, you just gotta say it's a new season. And so the past in the past, uh, we know we're capable of doing. And so it's really it's just up to us to you know get back on track and where we want to be. Thanks, Ray. Thanks.